Hi everyone, this is Deborah. I ran across this today. This is my x-ray of my hip. I'm gonna put my hands there. But that's what my hip replacement looks like. It's kind of cool. It's right there. It's ceramic, okay. Yeah, that's x-ray of my hip. And I did have a, a spinal fusion. I have six rods in my back. But this is what I spent a lot of time doing today. Filling up my um, pill cases. What is this hanging off? It's a rubber band. I always wrap rubber bands around them so that they don't come undone, if you know what I mean. But I wanted to go over some of the meds that I have to take. Well, first is the EpiPen, because I, I got stung by a bee once and almost died. Um, I take this acai. And I take magnesium. I didn't even see this today. I don't know, but that's supposed to help your brain function. Okay. I take B12. A multivitamin. Cranberry. This wards off uh, any bladder infections or whatever and then I take the apple cider vinegar and I think this has really helped because I have definitely reduced my appetite with this and then I, I take biotin and I also take collagen which helps me a lot and oh I don't this is just for mucus but this stuff really works I'm telling you so, and then I take, this is from Costco for allergies. And then of course I'm on, I, I take uh, lisinopril, symphostatin, I take estradiol. Mm, let's see, what else? Oh, generic Norbax, yeah. I take all that stuff. And endomethacin. And since I stopped smoking in January, um, the doctor gave me generic Wellbutrin, which really helps because I used to take that in the past. And uh, a lot of the other uh, pills that the doctors would give me for depression would keep me up all night. It would stimulate my brain too much. So Wellbutrin is the only one that lets me go to sleep at night. And it also, you know, took away all the anxiousness if you want a cigarette. But I only smoked for a year uh, after my sister passed. That's how I had to deal with it. So, yeah, I get most of my meds from Rite Aid and Costco and Walgreens. So, uh, yeah. My doctor said that my blood work is always on point. It's never a problem. Um, yeah, I do have to work on a little bit of, let's see, uh, the total, my total cholesterol was 250. It's like 50 points over. I gotta work on that, but that's because of candy. And my HDL was 67 and the LDL was 149. And my triglycerides were normal. So, those are my stats. But I'm going to work on some of them. So, thank you for watching. Bye.